Hello YouTube, this is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions and today I'm going to show you how I custom made my Sony Z Ultra. First, my Sony Z Ultra, straight from Sony, unlocked, took it out the box and I got the white version as you can tell in the back, nice and pretty. I already installed a back glass screen protector so I have a glass screen protector in the back and in the front I don't have a glass screen protector but see these are some of the items that I'm going to use I got the front glass screen protector and I have the skin that you saw in the video check out the first video of the Sony Z Ultra custom made and uh, you see the end result and it is the front and also I have the um, side here the silver or the gold gold is nice but I'm going to go with the silver I just put, bought this here so you can see nice okay first thing you want to do is clean off the screen I got some wet one and a dry one here so we're going to just go it on and get that out the pack and get rid of that the best thing to do is Take your Z Ultra, and this is my Darth Vader. That's what I call it, Darth Vader. Go to power it off. Okay. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, Easy Computer Solutions, and I bring it in all good new videos once a week. So keep that in mind while she's shutting down. Sony Z Ultra, 6.44 inch screen, Snapdragon 800 processor, fast. This is my go-to device right here. All right, so what I do is I'm just applying a little wet one here because I want to put that glass screen protector on there. And I want to make sure my screen is nice and clean here. Go ahead on and dry it off. Nice and clean. Make sure it's nice and clean. Because once you put this glass screen protector on there, it's uh, no getting it off. I want to make sure. The key part of this is to try to get it as fast as you can before you get dust particles on there. Because you, you don't want the dust particles. If you do get dust particles on there, you can use the dust absorber. And it gets some off, and you, as you can tell, some of the dust is coming on there as we speak. Okay. Okay, so what you do is we want to apply the glass screen protector on there. You want to go ahead on and get it peeled off here. Okay. Put it on there, got it on there nice and straight. Yep, you notice it sinks itself on there. Pretty. Okay. Now, we got our glass screen protector on there. Let's take a look at that. Oh, beautiful. Did it right the first time. Okay. First thing you want to do is we want to get the back on here first. Okay. Peel it off. You want to get that right and easy on there. The best thing you do is I start from corner to corner. Get it on there, nice and simple. You notice it just goes right on. Just let it go right on. Just like that to smooth it out. Now that's the back part. Nice and easy. They make these real easy, not hard at all, real simple. Take a look at that. Great, awesome. Okay, so we finished the back. Now let's do the front. The 
the skin on and you have to match the ports, the sensors. So, what I usually do is start from the top here, get it matched up. And even if you make a mistake, this is vinyl. It works out good. You can restick it, put it on there. Make sure you don't cover up the sensors. Once you get the top on, nice and simple. You want to kind of get the bottom part draped on there like so. And uh, get the bottom on there. It's always the most difficult part because you want to get it nice and even. Okay. And voila. There you go. Okay. So we got the skin on. Take a look at that. Take a look at that. Voila. Beautiful. Okay. Now, let's get this out the way. Put that in the camera shot so you can see it. Okay. I'm going to go with the silver one because it matches. The gold one is pretty. Take a look at that gold. It's beautiful. Okay. All right. Now, this comes with screws there and uh, comes with the screwdriver. Okay. So the best way to do this is slide the Z Ultra in. We'll get this in here. Get the top part in first. Okay. It ain't too difficult. It takes a little patience. Okay. If you notice the sides come up a little bit, so you gotta kinda Get that underneath that. Same thing with the back. The back goes on pretty easy. See that? Get a close up of that. Okay. So now once we get that, time for the screws. Okay. What I usually do is I just take the little screws and they're kind of small now. Get it in there. Nice and easy. Try to do one screw at a time. Get it in there. Okay. First screw in. Let's go with the second screw. And we're gonna go down and put that second screw in there. All right. Ten minutes, and you have a custom-made phone. And you could do this with uh, any phone, dbrand.com and amazon.com to get the, the bumper case. And this bumper case is aluminum bumper case from Amazon. Okay. And you just got to take your corners, kind of take your fingernail and curve them in there. See that? Take my fingernail, curve it in there. Okay? Take your fingernail, curve it in there. Fingernail, just curve it on in there. And it goes in there great. That's it. That's it. So, this is my custom made Sony Z Ultra. 6.44 inch screen and it's rocking lollipop good animation there there you go okay so like and subscribe my videos uh, give me a thumbs up if you like what you saw share my videos and check me out on Facebook Easy Computer Solutions, and we'll see you on the next video. Thank you.